and uh, i got converted in july so the experience you converted to which religion again which religion did you get converted to skip hoga na <laughs> okay i'm so sorry uh, you were saying about yeah so Hi guys, we have a very special guest with us today. Uh, this is Rani Jain. She is currently working at Amazon, uh, and she is someone who I know for some time now. Uh, she is actually a really good programmer. So um, I'll just ask you to talk more about yourself, if that's if that's okay. Yeah. Hello guys, I'm Rani Jain. I work in Amazon. I'm from NIT Bhopal. Okay, NIT Bhopal. So that is uh, in Madhya Pradesh, then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay i i'm just kidding of course i know where it is mm okay so nit bhopal uh, are there a lot of people from nit bhopal bhopal who work at amazon no there are 5 to 6 people only all right 5 to 6 people that's a little more than maybe father agnel from my batch so <laughs> uh what do you think it was the most important thing that you did which got you here today at uh, this company so i started competitive programming in first year after first sem so maybe that helped for sem my god so uh, did you uh, uh, yeah. so did you actually enjoy it or were you thinking about uh, getting better at algorithms i mean what is the motivation mainly when you started when i started i was like uh, i started randomly and i was uh, i started doing it uh, more frequently and i started enjoying it so wow. okay so it's like a step by step process yeah. where you enjoyed the thing because you started learning from it yeah. okay that's 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 awesome for semester oh my god i think you you must be one of the early starters then yeah but uh, after first sem after first sem <laughs> okay okay for sem break i was free so i thought uh, okay let's see what people do and right. uh, yeah yeah even i was doing the same thing but uh, i was doing uh, skip 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 uh, <laughs> okay uh the next thing that i would like to ask you rani in this very controversial list of questions that we have over here is uh, do you still do it Uh, no <laughs> because of work i don't get time so i don't do now but uh, sometimes i do some contests on code chef for code forces is it is it the right is it still the same thing like i don't do it a, uh, anymore and most of the programmers like the famous guys who used to do really well anudeep uh, and i think uh, there's a lot of programmers who were excellent at it and now they have stopped what do you think would be i mean what what, what is your main reason uh, although you have given it but still maybe work the pressure of work right or uh, whenever like uh, we get free time now i'm just like okay job lag gaya tha so na tum logon ne yahi hai sach but all right um the next thing that i would like to ask you is when you know you we are programming and especially in computer programming there's a lot of times when it's very frustrating yeah um and improving is not a one step process that we say okay i'm going to improve and we're going to improve so what did you do to get better at computer programming firstly solving easy prob- problems doesn't help so i started with easy problems and uh, for a few months i did only easy problems and then when i switched to some more difficult problems then i was very frustrated i was like what the hell is this and there was there were no resources like defined resources so i have to google things and uh, look at the multiple blogs and stuff so that was a bit challenging and uh, what improved okay solving medium to difficult problems and learning more i think solving more problem helps wow wow okay that's the most important thing that rani has given us the secret to getting better at uh, pro- compare programming uh, googling well <laughs> but I think that's a very important thing like lots of people ask you I'm sure uh, they ask everyone who's good at computer programming that how do I start or how do I get better yeah. so do you tell them the same thing or uh, do you just be like kon hai ye so if i know the person i'll tell him to like st- at least start and not only search things like where do i start what do i do and i just tell them okay let's start first and then he will gradually improve perfect oh god yes this is validating what i have said earlier <laughs> okay so reni i think uh, the, the way that i met reni actually was that uh, on hackerer there was a project competition and uh, she was 
she's one of the like high five people on hacker earth she's actually really good at projects and she's done a lot of projects uh, what i would like to ask you is uh, what are the what are your favorite projects and what do you think it took to actually complete them so apart from apart from competitive programming i did uh, some projects as well and hackathons as well because uh, the culture in my college was uh, people were not knowing hack what hackathon us are so uh, doing that also helped me a lot and uh, i learned a lot with these projects and hackathons so what would be your favorite project or what was your final year project i think that's most people's like favorite <laughs> so my so there is a buzz around uh, ml and uh, artificial intelligence so my final year project was that only some uh, election data was there i don't remember <laughs> that the importance of the final year project in 30 seconds <laughs> just prove it she doesn't remember guys so uh, okay now your experience at uh, i mean you have done an internship also i think uh, yeah, i did an internship in microsoft two right. month internship okay okay so what was your favorite thing at microsoft Rachit is recording this video. <laughs> Rachit is recording this video and is going to tear everyone apart. <laughs> <laughs> okay, one project I did was a, it was kind of a startup and uh, it was a hackathon project. We started it and uh, we submitted that same project in four five hackathons and we won in Airtel hackathon. So that was uh, a five to six month long project and I learned a lot in that. it was from scratch and uh, i learned a lot of concepts in that so that helped me that project helped me in interviews as well i think the most important thing to take over here is that she submitted in five or six places and you should submit in as many places as you can even if the project quality is not very good at the end of the day once somebody you have a, sorry once you have a good idea <laughs> once you have a good idea or uh, a project you can submit it at to multiple places and multiple competitions and hackathons and uh, simultaneously you can improve that as well according to the constraints that uh, the people give in hackathons yeah jokes apart yeah that's true uh, when you are on a project for 6 months then you know you have to submit in multiple places and that's that's a smart thing that you did but of course submit everywhere and in the end you win so uh, so what is your experience till now on amazon and we are out of questions <laughs> so i started with a 6 month intern in amazon i joined in february and um, i got converted in july i was like already full time intern so there was no conversion like kind of thing but i converted to full time in uh, july and after that i switched thank you so much reni uh, there's something else that reni does really well and that is gymming so um, i think we actually caught her in between her pull up workout at number 37 Eight, right? That's three seventy eight pull-ups you did on the day. Three seven eight zero, maybe. Three seven eight zero. I'm sorry, I always miss the last decibel, and that's why my manager also gives me appraisals, which are one decibel cut. So, thank you, thank you so much, Reni, for being such a sport and uh, for uh, you know making my attire come to some use today. We have actually asked so many people today for an interview. We were, I and Rachit were walking on the street and asking random people, and everyone's like, no. We're not going to take an interview, but Reni was such a sport. She's agreed to an interview. Thank you so much. Thank you, Gaurav. Thank you, Rachit. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Special thanks to Rachit who was behind the camera, and of course, thanks to our channel members who make these videos possible. I'll see you next time.